I am ready to shorty Nam the Colonel if granted bail. Ojikalo say Senator Ojikalo has expressed his willingness, readiness to stand as shorty for Nam the Colonel if he's being granted bail by the federal government. Yes. The chief whip of the Senate said this on Tuesday, January 10, when he appeared as a guest on China's television. In his words, I will shorty, I will serve shorty, shorty for him if the federal government wants to release him to me. That's what Carlos said. He went on to say that, you know, that, uh, that he, he won't abandon the family of Oyendo doing prolonged predicament with the Nigerian government. In his words, I made his father the traditional ruler of their place when I was governor. I am close to them, but they didn't listen to me. But that will not make him to abandon. That will not make me to abandon them. I will not abandon them. I will stand short here for him if the federal government wants to release him to me. And I can keep him in my compound here in Abuja or Ibere, in Abia, and counsel him. This is what Oji Zakalo is saying, that he will stand as Shati. First and foremost, look, we are not fools. You will stand as Shati, but we have seen your activities so far. And now you said if Federman granted bail, which kind of bail is that? Are we talking of bail at this time? Are we talking about bail, bail? I think that one is a forgotten alternative. It has been overtaken by serious events. All right. Do my further high court and the Abuja Court of Appeal. Yes, the Court of Appeal at the Abuja Division. Okay? What we are talking about, what everyone is saying now, is the unconditional release of Mazen Amdekan, hinged on this premise of what? Court judgments. The appeal court judgment? And do Maya, Federal High Court. Appeal court judgment quashed, quashed, quashed all the frivolous charges, quashed it completely, discharged and acquitted Mazen Amdekan. The Federal High Court faulted everything about the extraordinary rendition and said the worst case scenario is take him back to where you picked him from yes take him back to what where you picked him from if you can't release him in nigeria now take him back because you committed you know atrocity even the ap court for the federal government in their extraordinary rendition of Fonyendo. They said it explicitly. The torturing, the, the abduction at Kenya in collaboration with the Kenyan government. Not only the abduction in Kenya, but also the torturing and the torturing also while he was transported in the airplane, they were torturing him. While in the detention facility, torturing him. The happy called faulted the government in all this and said, look, you don't have ground for all these charges. There's no basis for these charges. Rather, they are worried on you. Yes, for compensation, compensation. The government have to compensate him for all these things they committed against this man. Dehumanizing him. You know, strip him of his fundamental human rights in their abracadabra and impunity. And so, having said that, the court said, look, we have discharged and acquitted this young man. And someone is telling us, I will serve as a shorty. I will do this to Onyendu when he will come to my place at Ibere 
or at uh, my place at Abuja. Who is interested in that? Who is interested in that? If you left, you are Abuja word, Abuja mansion. Nobody's interested in that. It got to work. Go and refund the people their money first and foremost. Go and refund you, you. The man was there, you know, for eight years as the governor of the state. Looted the state dry. He has been convicted in the court. But the Gingerwood government, you know, playing hide and seek, saying they're fighting corruption, whereas they are looking for the opponent. So they now brought him out under street conditions. For this, if you see these conditions, you know, you will leave your mouth wide open. So now he's talking about bail. And um, just, not just bail, that they should release, him, release mercy to him. He should cancel him. It is mercy that's supposed to cancel you. He has been canceling you guys, but you people are intransigent. Maybe you will need a closer rehabilitation or counseling by Onyendo. Yes. Not the other way around. How can you, the Lord Jesus Carlos, saying he want to cancel my son? Who is listening to you? Have you convinced one single person in the South East to follow you? If not, all this uh, bracket about you're doing with money. Election day, you come with money and start buying votes. Convince people, let us see if they will understand what you're saying if they follow you. If, they, if you're making sense at all. And that person, you're not making any sense. You want to go and convince or uh, counsel someone. You want to go and counsel the person, a leader, who have large wealth the whole of the Biafran land, across the whole world. People are listening to him. Intellectuals are listening to him. And you say you want to counsel him. You want to counsel that person. So it, that means you, you have to go to the rehabilitation center to check yourself. Yes? That is it. Let us face the reality. If this man goes to rehabilitation center or psychiatric you know, center, they will detain him there. They will detain him. I just tell you. He will not go that same day. Even if he must go, they will give him bed. At least to relax, to stay, so that they will properly examine him. I tell you. And this, that person is talking about counseling someone. Not just someone, but, you know, a leader, a hero, a legend, a living legend. Doing his young, doing his young, but he's a legend. I've done so powerful things at his age, I've achieved so many things. Followed by, you know, you know, you know, you know, you know, you know the, beer, the entire beer fans are behind him. The national community, people who love freedom. So that's why we are, we are talking about, you know, you know, the, the international community, the world powers, the United Nations, to align, align themselves, align themselves with the choices of the people, with the, with the masses movement. Align yourself. Don't be anti-people. Aligning yourself is meaning that you have to come and conduct this referendum. Simple. And so, Ojizokalu, go and, uh, you know, hide your, your face.